Hello. So in this video, I would like to share several ideas of using GIFs to enhance learning and teach you a simple tip on adding animated GIF to your Google Slides or Google Docs or any online document. Now GIF, G-I-F, some people pronounce it as GIF, is a type of computer file like JPG or PNG that contains animated or moving images, just like this little um, little bunny here. It's an abbreviation for graphic interchange format. So I found that adding GIFs to my presentation has been especially helpful for my learners because it not only spices up your HyperDoc or your Google Slides, but it's a form of providing comprehensible input for our language learners and all learners actually, and providing a multiple representation of language heavy content in a, a visual and concrete manner. So let's look at some of my examples. So here's a presentation that I used on teaching main idea and details. And I wanted to give my students a visual, an animated visual to emphasize that having strong and adequate amount of supporting details help and strengthen your main idea. Now, once my students saw this animated visual, they immediately got it and it really helped them retain this concept much better than a still visual or still image or me just explaining it verbally. You can also use GIF to highlight keywords or just provide emphasis on your presentation, or you can actually use GIF to teach new vocabulary to enhance their learning and help them retain new vocabulary. Here is a couple more examples of the usage of GIF in my presentation. This one is used as a visual prompt, not a picture prompt, but a GIF prompt um, to identify the main idea and details. And they identify the main idea of this GIF prompt and identify the example details. There's another one on Peppa Pig. Main idea and details. Also, you can use a pointer GIF just like here to remind students to click on a certain hyperlink that is on your presentation. So you can use animated GIFs and be creative in your teaching practice. So here's how you add these animated GIFs to your Google Slides. It's very, very easy. First, go to Google Search. Sorry there. And you're going to type a keyword that you would like to. All right, I'm going to type decision. And then you're going to type animated GIF or GIF at the end. Okay, so I type decision. Decision is the word that I want to teach, decision. And you're going to type animated GIF at the end. I'm going to go to images. And you will see lots of different GIF ideas. You're going to choose a GIF that you like best or may seem most appropriate for your needs. Okay, I like this one that shows the meaning of the word, the target word decision. Now, the easiest way to add this GIF is to drag and drop the GIF into your Google Slides presentation. Just like that. There you go. So my target word is decision. The definition is here, a choice that you make after a careful thought and a sentence explaining my animated image here. So 
The question is, what decision will the robot make? And the students can interact with this target word using the GIF tier and say the robot will make a decision to wear a shirt with a sun because it is prettier. All right, so that is an opportunity for your students to output the target word into their writing or into their speaking using the GIF as a visual. Easy peasy, right? So you now have an animated GIF in your Google Doc and your Google Slides. Um, thank you so much for listening. And let me know if you have any creative ways to using GIFs and animated images in your teaching.